Lindenwood has moved up to Division I this year, and they have the quarterback to do it. Cade Brister is insane. For example, yesterday, he threw for five touchdowns in a 35-34 to loss to Tennessee Tech. Brister was named the OVC Player of the Week. Randy Schwankert has more on his amazing career in tonight's Spotlight Story. The Lindenwood Lions have surprised their competition in the Ohio Valley Conference. As a coach, you always wonder, you know, okay, how, how's this going to roll out? But as I got in fall camp and I saw the chemistry of this team, I, I, I tell you, I'm not surprised where we're at. The Lions are on a four-game winning streak with a 6-2 and two overall record. The team is being led by a hometown native. I'm Cade Brister, and I'm the quarterback at Lindenwood University. Brister uncorks one down the sideline looking for Rose and another spectacular catch. Brister has set the school record with 10,277 passing yards and a record of 89 passing touchdowns. He's also rushed for 1,840 yards as a quarterback, the most in program history. You know, Cade's just uh, he's a very unique uh, football player, that, you know, that, that come along uh, only a few times in a career. You know, when you talk about leadership, when you talk about um, you know, his uh, love for the game, but, you know, his desire to be want, want to be great. Cade's leadership plays a key role in dealing with their new competition. You know, just play-wise, we kind of just, Coach Digger dummied it down for us. And it's like, look, it's just football, go out there and perform. And, um, you know, they tie our shoes just like us. And, you know, this year with the success, I think St. Louis can see that Lindenwood's uh, definitely ready and is Division I football. Lindenwood has a roster of over 100 players. I think like 60% of our roster is St. Louis. Lindenwood's just the spot to be at right now, and I think that the city can definitely see the way it's going. And any recruits out there that are, you know, teetering around where they want to go, this is definitely a special place that does it the right way. Cade's family plays a big role in his life. My parents never missed a game. You know, even they, they traveled for me, but it's been really nice that, you know, they drive 20 minutes up the road, and they're really familiar with the area, and my grandpa gets to come to a lot. And my, my brother works across the river at uh, DePaul Hospital as a nurse, so he gets to come to a lot of the games too. So I've been really blessed with this situation here. As the season comes to an end, Cade's future is just starting. I want to get into coaching heavily and uh, I love the game so much and I've seen the impact that uh, Coach Stugert's had on us and you know to create better men and do it the right way and have a winning culture and I can't get away from the game so I'll be, I'll be coaching college here next year.